Mother's Market. It's a grocery store, but some of them do have uh, little restaurants in here as well. And uh, So we're just taking you on a shopping trip. Yep. Yes. That's what this is. Yes. Yes. So let's go. Okay, here we go. Should we start down on the bread aisle? Yeah, let's start on the bread <laughs> aisle that we can't eat. The only time I really want to look are for things like this package of paleo thins. thins. Okay, let me grab that for you. But look, that's, yeah, coconut that's like there. almost $19 for how many? Ten. Ten. These coconut wraps are gluten-free, they're vegan, and they're paleo. And so this is not vegan, so for the ones that are eating vegan, you can't eat this bread. But this is by far the best bread that I've ever had. This Canyon House, yummy, delicious, best freaking gluten-free, soy-free bread I've ever had, but it does contain eggs, so if you're a vegan, obviously you can't fucking have this shit. So they, they have these pre-made uh, cauliflower um, pizza crusts for those that are trying to do like keto, right? See how many of them. Are but they some of them free though? Free. But they're not vegan. Three. No, what I'll do, oh my god, these are expensive too. Wait for cheese eaters, Organic Valley is really good. Yeah. Moving along, are you buying cheese? Uh, no. Nope. Um, so they have, at some of the mothers, they have like um, pre made like soups that are out. They have a salad bar. Brand of vegan cheese and they make um, a oh, I got, butter. I got that kind the other day. And it's gluten free and soy free. I and love it, the butter. And it has very low carbs. The butter actually has zero carbs. For the, so for those that are vegan and eat keto, I do remember yeah. the butter has zero carbs and it's really good. It melts really well. Um, it was like the most delicious thing I've ever had. Difficult thing in life for me to get out right now. Holy crap. Yeah, it's vegan, gluten-free, dairy-free, soy-free. That's the ball right there. Yeah, try it out. Okay, um, and it's soy-free and gluten-free. There's Satan. I can't have Satan. I can't have Satan either. Satan, Satan. Yeah. Um. Uh, tempeh? Mm, no. Not. Is it organic? I usually try to buy as much organic food as I can. Me too. Sometimes I'm trying to follow a recipe and it calls for chives. Oh, yeah. And I can't find an organic chive well, or something like that. Usually here, the one good thing you'll yeah. notice here is that everything is pretty much organic here. If you're on so, a budget, though. Yeah, it, it can be pricey. This Let's is not see, the place to go, to have, be honest with you. Okay, look, organic. organic. What I have. I have, I have most of this stuff at home, to be honest. Me too. Organic. Great for roasting and stuffing. Shishito peppers. Soleil. At the Soleil they do it's vegan. Oh nice. But they make one that's soy free and gluten free. So sometimes they'll have ones that have like uh, they're they're like they use some kind of fake meat and then but they have one that doesn't have the fake meat, it's just not how many and it's definitely soy free and gluten free and vegan. Alright. I guess I'll try it. I'm going to try anything in the name of avocado. Just soy free. That's the bomb, huh? Yeah. Well, okay. I've had I haven't camel tried that milk. one. Camel milk. What? Pasteurized camel milk. What the hell's happening? Milk um, from a camel? I guess. <laughs> no, but I'm just saying. I guess. It's crazy. I wonder if it makes you want to hump. <laughs> hump? Because you know, camels. <laughs> camels have humps. <laughs> All right. This is, these are paleo, gluten-free, vegan. Ooh, um, and it looks and, like a poncho. And um, soy-free, gluten-free. What? All that? Yeah, and actually they're made in well, I don't know, I, I wouldn't, well, I don't understand what paleo means exactly. It means that you, if you were alive during the, what, the ice age, the stone age, that oh. you, you basically live off of what you can hunt and gather, right? Isn't that what the idea I of paleo haven't. is? No clue. I believe that's what it is. Okay. That's the family, somebody in the family, they're 
had a lot of like issues so they actually as far as like stomach issues and allergies and stuff so they actually started making this brand and it's all made in a gluten-free facility so you know how sometimes like you get something and it says you know processed in a facility with wheat soy nuts or whatever uh, their facility there doesn't is, have any of that yes there's a completely nice. gluten-free um they actually make chips they make hot sauce and they make uh tortillas and their tortillas are really bomb yeah. So if you have to cut this out, you have here? to cut it out. Yes, I'll, sh I'll show ah. you. They might use something else. Is there a sugar alcohol? What? What is that? Maltitol. I don't know. It melt. Does it melt at all in your mouth? <laughs> melt at all in your mouth? This is I don't know bizarre. what that means. This is I've never heard of maltitol, so I'm definitely not going to eat that. Here. <gasps> Maybe I need some sauerkraut. Yeah. Ooh. I'll take that big jar of sauerkraut. No, very little. Why oh, is I love Fats Domino? He's following you. He is following <laughs> me everywhere I go. I Alexa, love it. Alexa, be quiet. Hey, it's, I'm, we're not at my house. What is Bob using? Who's Bob? That's oh, Bob. Oh, Bob. Hi, Bob. He's eating a gluten-free. So a replacer vegan, re equivalent to 34 eggs because oh I, I need something for pancakes. Ooh, this is potato starch, tapioca flour, baking soda, psyllium husk fiber. Oh, I, I want to try that. Me too. Yeah. Because I can eat this, right? Thanks, Bob. Bob. What? What? You're the bomb.com, Bob. I have the weirdest shit in my cart right now. <laughs> Because I do have stuff at none home. None of it makes like a meal. None of it. No, I, I have fake meat at home and okay. stuff I can use. I have stuff at home. I just don't want to like buy in abundance and have all this crap at my house. I do have stuff at home. So I know I have really weird random stuff in my cart, but I have other stuff at home. They have a little bulk suction. I didn't they even do. know that. Yeah. All right. They have a huge one at the one in Santa Ana. This one's kind of a smaller one compared to the other ones, some of the other ones, but there's like a huge... They have garbanzo beans. Hmm. All right. Here she comes. She got some. She's going to soak them and see what she could do with Let's them. Let's see what happens. Hydro flask here for those that need hydro flask. No, they do. They have a lot of different, like, also, at Mother's, like I said, they have lots of different herbal stuff. So if you guys want to go the herbal route and do something, if you have, like, a cold or depression there's you know different herbs and stuff you can take and mothers is a great place to find all that stuff um they have a lot of like well, let's smell detoxing this. stuff let's smell these soaps okay avocados i, I love today. avocados about the avocado trade oh. green gold the best in the oh west oh my gosh i'm not joking people. one they also make a cilantro and a jalapeno one which is my mother's favorite Oh, look at why do I talk about my mom all the time? That's why she's like, oh, I love your videos. Because <laughs> I give her shout outs. <laughs> Hi, Hi, Dawn. Dawn. <laughs> um, but yeah, so they have make really good, and they actually make garlic spread and different stuff, which is the bomb as Mine. well. I can't, I'm having to stay away from that. Do you know I just okay, was so holding it for this, so long? I, I wanted to make this. It's making me sad. Oh, look it, I can walk. Do you want me to walk around the rest of the store yes. with it on my head? I could do that. <laughs> Okay. All, right. All right, so I don't think we're gonna shop for anything else. No. We're just gonna go ahead and check out. We're gonna check out and then we'll do our sign off outside. We wanna yeah. turn off and then we'll sign out and yeah. talk about next week outside. Yeah, let's okay. do that. Okay, okay. Um, Hillary's is a really good brand that I mentioned earlier. The um, So did you have a shopping list coming into this? No, I never have a shopping list. My brain just can't focus on shopping lists, so I just go in and go in. So she had a shopping list. I did. I had a shopping list. I got four out of five things. Yeah, and I personally just got some stuff to try that I haven't tried before because, like, the sour cream I haven't tried, the cauliflower I've always actually made my own in the past, and but I just thought I'd try... Um, You're pretty brand. good at knowing these brands, though. I don't yeah. really know that much information. Yeah. I, I usually don't try the different brands and substitutes so you're you're better at that department than I am. yeah and 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 like i said there's other good brands like hillary's uh all soy free um wheat free you can find those in the frozen uh food section but, so. you know one of the things that i wanted to touch on that i mentioned in one of our past shows was for people that don't have all of these nice little restaurants to go to uh what what should you look for when you go shopping yeah doesn't mean that these products are going to be available 
And, and you know what though, I was saying earlier when you were grabbing something, actually like going to the regular grocery store, of course if you live in like Oregon, you're going to have a really good easy time, you know what I mean, bigger places. But um, I notice that even at regular grocery stores lately that a lot of stuff I find they're putting out more and more gluten-free stuff. Yeah. So hey, yeah. a lot of different and isn't there the, the stores new, available oh, online. Yeah, that Thrive Market. Yeah, I, 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 I did have a, a membership with them. I, I ended up canceling it just because of what my needs are. I wasn't, I wasn't going to be buying often enough, but it is actually a low price. You yeah, do a year for like forty dollars, and then you have a membership. Try right. um, and I was looking around, but I hate, hate, hate when you go for those like those uh, home delivery meal places. And I was trying to see if there was ones that were vegetarian, gluten free, and soy free, but they don't let you look at the menu before hand so i'm not gonna like give them my information yeah and shit like that because that drives me nuts so if you guys know of any oh, those, ones i'll try that and those ready-made meal you know, ones yes yeah. and i will do that for like a week or two and let you guys know my experience if anybody out there knows any that are vegetarian and or vegan uh soy free and gluten free drop them in the comments below so i can know because i really wanted to try it and see if it worked out well for me we don't want to we already cut so many things out of our diet yeah things that we do like we shouldn't have to completely eliminate them. We just want to make sure, sure that they're not the only thing that we go to. It's not a crutch. Yeah, because that definitely was my crutch. It was like every day, that's what I, and I would laugh at myself and go, oh my God, this is all I freaking need is neon, like all the time. It's and it's good that I'm finding out other products, to be honest with you, because there was a lot of other products I didn't know before or I haven't tried before. And now I'm doing that because of the fact that I'm cutting out the Beyond Me. Like hummus. Hummus hummus hummus, 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 raw, raw garlic hummus every day. Frankly, I, after this show, I think I'm tired of hummus. I'm not even <laughs> going to eat this hummus. You're going to be like throwing it out the no, window? I'm just going to throw it out the window. No, don't let her kids. We're just joking. Her daughter would be Stop. mad. Where? Why? Because she doesn't like litter. <laughs> but next week we are going to so, Yeah, next do week we're going to be doing something fun, non-food related. Yes. We're going to be at Hollywood's forever cemetery and it's a special day which i'm not going to talk about until next week Ooh. as long as we can get on the grounds yes so we'll see you at hollywood forever cemetery next week yeah but <clears throat> so i hope you guys did find some useful information i mean we're obviously not going to go into the vegetables and stuff and tell you like oh we buy this vegetable because you guys have your own preference you know what i mean like like we said earlier we try to buy as much organic, organic. As, as possible it is pricey it is but, pricey but you know you're saving money in the future yeah the way i, I look at yeah. it your investment yeah is well worth it and, and um, buying all yeah we do want to thank people for commenting on yes. our last video there's not there weren't any challenges, so Carrie's off the hook this week. Yes, and we, if you have any questions for us, please comment, let yeah, us know. I mean, we'll, we'll try to get to that gum wall. I know that there's one in Seattle. So if you know of another one that we, it, we might be close to, then be more there specific. One in like twice we in have um, a couple of good shows coming up that we have planned. There's another Southern California tree coming up, mm -hmm. I believe. Yes, and then and we're going to be in then New Orleans. we're going to be out of town Yay. in a big way. Oh, um, Ooh, what do you want to see us wear for Halloween? Okay, yeah, that, or what do you think we're going to be? Because I already know what I'm going to be. Oh, you figured it I out? I figured it nice. out. I'm going to talk to her about it All right. on the way home. But, yeah, I already. but what do you think we're going to be? Or you can comment that. Yeah, comment or below. what do you think Ideas we should be? Yes. on who sh or what we should be for Halloween. Yeah. And see if you could think of what... Well, some of you, I did tell a couple people, so, oh, but so don't, if I don't told ruin you, it. don't ruin don't it. Don't ruin it. Don't ruin it, mofos. All right. All right. Anyway. All right. So we'll see you next fun. week. It's been fun. Thanks for grocery shopping with us. I know. And we'll see you next week. Bye. Bye.